If you are a wedding photographer or photo retoucher, you should give this preset a try. It can transform your ordinary wedding photos into a masterpiece. Hi everyone, I'm Nissan and in today's video, I will demonstrate how to create this amazing camera raw preset for wedding pictures in Photoshop. Let's dive in without any further delay. First I'm going to duplicate the background layer, then right click to the layer and convert to a smart object. Converting to a smart object preserves the original layers and allows for non-destructive editing. Now let's go to the filter menu then select camera raw filter. As you can see it has different type of adjustments. Let's begin with the light. I am keeping exposure around minus 60, contrast around 30. Highlight minus 40. Increase the shadow and decrease the whites and blacks. These light settings are mostly depends on your picture. Now let's move on to the color setting. Let's increase the temperature to 20. And let's make the tint 15. Then reduce the vibrance and saturation. After that go to the effects and increase the dehaze. Now reduce the texture and clarity if you want. I'm going to add some grain to make it look professional. Now let's make some curve adjustment. I'm adjusting highlights, lights, dark and shadows. Then let's go to this point curve and drag the left curve point to the up. It will make fade effect. And then go to the red channel and drag the curve point upside to add some redness. After that go to the green channel and drop down the curve point. Now go to the blue channel and drop down the curve point to make it little alloys. As you can see how much differences the curve has made. Now the final step go to the color mixer. Let's go to the green. Make sure it just is set in color not HSL. Then decrease the green color saturation. After that go to the yellow color and decrease the yellow color saturation as well. And that's it. You have created a masterpiece and it was quite simple. To save these adjustments as presets, just go to the presets. Click the three dots, choose create preset, give it a name and click ok. Let's apply this preset in another picture. I have this picture and all I have to do is go to the camera raw filter and then go to the presets. I will choose the preset that I just created and saved. And that's it. I hope you learned something new today. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.